Okay, cool, cool. Right. I'll, I'll explain about getting into the factory. There's a way of doing it, right? And what you have to do is you have to make sure that both mechs are pointing and looking in a different direction. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to go up some stairs and you'll basically be able to be seen by the max. There's also puppets at the top, more than likely. I mean, there will be only one or two. So you want to crouch as much as you can uh, after you get to the top of the stairs and run like your ass is on fucking fire <laughs> to get up to the top, basically. Uh, and we'll, we'll do it. So what you're going to do is wait until the Mac that comes from the left, which I'm facing where, where, where he comes from. So wait until he comes underneath basically you know like the the bridge and then wait until he goes back round to the left and then the one that comes from the right goes round to the right so just make sure that you they're sort of facing away uh, and then we we run up the stairs but i'll show you uh, you know all you have to do is just follow me you'll be fine oh and if there's any puppets around make sure you stay away because i'll be swinging the fucking katana <laughs> Right, go for it, man. And when you get to the top, get down, just crouch down, make sure you don't appear above the window. Oh, I'll go in there, dude. Now watch out, there's two, two puppets here. Alright, okay cool. Make sure you search the puppets as well when you've downed them, because uh, you'll get awareness for that. I just found it. I just found a screwdriver as well. I wouldn't bother. No, you're you're above. Be careful. You're above the thing. Right, you're relatively safe here. I just found a fucking nice. Oh, oh! I just found a nice helmet. But if I find one for you, I'll, I'll give it to you. Don't worry. So if you find any, if you find any nails, save them. Or bolts. Na nails or bolts can be useful. I just found a box of nails, it's perfect. And I found some shotgun rounds. Right, I'm just going to reload the shotgun again. About four, four different rounds. I oh, would need a piss as well. Typical. Your piss or your pistol? No, I need my character needs a piss. Oh, got you. <laughs> this is why I choose a woman because she uh, crouches down to piss, whereas a man stands up. You see, so not very covert. 
Right, now what we're going to do is we're going to head up the stairs here. Now we can be seen by this mech on the left hand side, so just be aware of that. And there should be maybe one or two puppets at the top. I'll take them out of the katana anyway. And then afterwards what we're going to do is head down the bottom. We'll try and take out any puppets that are downstairs from up here with the pistols before we go down. Oh, there's a cargo drop as well, but it's miles away, I think. So just just be careful to sort of keep to the side and be aware of where he is. Nice, nice helmet for you there, mate. Just next to you. <laughs> I just found two boxes of bolts. Right, I'll go and have a look, see if there's any puppets. No, it's alright, it's clear. So j just loot as much as you can. Yeah, loot as much as you can and, and leave it in this corner. Leave the loot in this corner, we'll sort of work out what we want to take and what we don't want to take. Yeah, I've got a box of nails anyway, so... Sorry, what was that? Bolts? Yeah, the, there's a box of bolts over there. They take up two slots, so if you do find, I mean, if you do find a few, then yeah, take them up, you know. You can make cabinets with them. Batteries are useful because you can use them for recharging stuff. Just found a 911. Just found an M82 mag. Do you, want a, do you want a knife? I found a nice little knife here. It's a little con eye. You can make them out of metal in a toolbox, but I'll give you this one. It's better than a stone knife. Right. Um.
Found a compass, two pairs of binoculars and a flare. The flare is useful because you can use it for grouping puppets together or distracting or robots as well, so it's quite useful. I'll take the binoculars, I'll, leave, I'll usually leave them behind. Now, I'm going to have a look outside, but you've got to be really careful because the mech can, can see over the edge. I found some 939 for the AS valve. Uh, can I through there? Don't know if I can. Oh. Yeah, I can't get through the window, never mind. I have to go back. Over a crowbar. I'll we'll take the crowbar. Away. Right. So what we're going to do is we need to drop loads of shit here, and then basically work out what we don't need. Oh, did you find the, the holster? Yeah. yeah. Um, you might as well eat the sardines, and that'll give you a boost to your energy at least. I'm going to drop a lot of shit here because uh, there might be stuff at the bottom and I probably won't have space for it so but it shouldn't, hope, hopefully it won't vanish on the M82 mag it's probably worth a thousand but you know um, I'm going to drop that take those, take that I might drop, I might drop the crow barrier actually um, yeah See what I want to take with me um, at the moment. Yeah, no. Right. So there's going to be a few puppets at the bottom. Now the only robot that can see you is the one that goes all the way round. But when you right at the end, the front, there's another robot on the right hand side that can see you. So just be aware of your line of sight with the robot. The other one that's behind us, you know, the one that sort of takes that little circuit. He can't see us there, but there will be a few puppets, I think. Be ca and be careful of firing off any unsilenced shots or anything like that. You know, if you find another gun or whatever else. I mean, I've got a shotgun, but I, I don't want to use it because um, obviously you, you fire that, they all come fucking running. Which can be useful because, you know, if you're stuck somewhere and you've got loads of ammo, you can sort of bring them to you. Um, so, anyway, we'll go and have the butchers and see what we can find. Just, uh, I'm really sorry to do this to you, man, but I've got a phone call and I've got to deal with it. Hey, it's fine. Look, I locked the door. I locked the door and um, I I'm still eating my bloody pot noodle anyway. <laughs> All right, man. Cool. All right, well, uh, I, I won't be too long. I'll be right back. Yeah, that's fine. No problem.
call yeah. about that. Uh, it's alright. Don't... Calls and me answer calls. It's alright, no problem. She's probably just checking up on you, make sure you're okay. Right, I've I've taken what I need. What what I'm gonna do is I'm because we're sort of right at the top, I'm gonna drop this stuff down at the other end and then you know we can pick through it before we go. Now there is a there is a different way we can go back, or we can go back the same way. The other way is slightly harder, but anyway, we just follow me, we'll work it out. Just watch out for this bloody map though. Oh shit. Yeah, get out of the way. <laughs> Did he see you? Uh, I mean, but there are other people on the server. I think there's five other people. So potentially it was somebody else, but I don't know. I guess he just deals with line of sight. But anyway, when he goes down, uh, sorry, when he goes around, we'll, we'll go, we'll go. Oh, no, he's not going. He's this, is, this is what happens with the, when they're made away, you see. It'll disrupt his normal route. So, see, yeah, he's on yellow at the moment. So he's sort of like alerted. You see his light in front of him, it's all yellow. So he's going to be alerted at the moment. Yeah. So once he goes back to his normal routine, he should. Yeah, so just follow. Right, so what we're going to do is, um, right, right at the far end of this building, there's another walkway that goes to the left. So what we're going to do is head down there. Uh, I don't think any of the mechs can see us, uh, unless, oh, they might be able to see us through the window, so you just have to be aware of that. But we're going to head all the way down to the end through this door, and then we're going to clear that place out. There'll probably be only a couple of puppets. And then we're going to drop our shit there, <laughs> pretty much. Just, just be careful. There's a hole here. Don't fall down a hole. You'll probably die. And watch out, because I'm going to be swinging the katana. Yeah, it was just the one. Just search everything. Watch, yeah, watch out, watch out. That was my fault. <laughs> Yeah, that was my fault. Because you're very visible through the windows. Right, so we're going to head back. Head back to the when, where we came from, okay? So go back to that door down there. Right, whilst we're here, there's a puppet down there. I'm going to take him out with the pistol. It saved me, sort of. Uh... Just watch out for that hole. I'm just there are a couple more down. I'm just checking. Yeah, I might have to. I might have to move around to the side. Oh, you can get it, can you?
Where did he go? Oh, he's there. Did you get it? Okay, well what I'm going to do is drop all my shit here, right? But uh, So basically, there might be a lot of stuff down there, you might not be able to carry it back up. So drop as much as you can here, and then we'll work through it when we uh, when we come back. We'll come back the, back, so the same way, that'll be safest, I think. Right, I found a... Um, yeah, just hold on to your, hold on to your screwdrivers because sometimes things do sort of vanish. But so your screwdrivers, your lockpicks, hold on to them, and anything else you don't want to lose, anything else you can drop. Right, you've got a thing in your rucksack called Phoenix Tears. Um, put that on the access key nor or one of the others. Basically what it is, that thing, when you inject yourself, it will take you straight from injured to recovery. Yeah, so it's like a fucking Superman. Yeah, that's a rapid recovery, yeah. you got three shots of that. Basically, normally it's only obtainable out of a locked box in a bunker. So admin's sort of giving it to us for free. Yeah, any any other server you wouldn't get it. Right. Right, I'm pretty much done so. I mean, admin's actually given us 5k each, which is pretty crazy, but um, if we ever get to a trader, at least we can buy, buy something there. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to head down the stairs. Uh, I mean, everything should be killed, but, you know, we'll, we'll see. And there's only one robot that can see you, and he, he goes, he, he's, that's the one that goes past there. So we should be alright. Yeah, don't don't worry about those puppets, man. All you're gonna do is attract attention of the, the robot. So if he if he does see you, hide behind one of the posts. And he shouldn't be able to shouldn't be able to get you then. And don't worry about the puppet you downed over there. Just you know, we just head down here. 